Hello everybody, I'm back again one more time, taking out that space on, on your beautiful shiny silver screen. Your amazing online weird friend Nick Dutch who reads tarot for a living and plays with runestones and does things with strange cards with weird symbols on them because he's strange. Very strange. Hmm. Well that's what some people think. If you met me socially you'd just regard me as being a normal ordinary everyday person really. But each to their own. I'm here to read for you, to give you a three card reading with the 40 servants and see whether you like it. And if you do, then give me a like. Give me a rate, subscribe, favorite, share. Uh, I'm saying these words far too often now. You know what I mean? Click the bell and all that stuff. Leave comments in the comment section because that's nice. It's just nice to see you caring for me enough to talk. Here's your first three, your only three cards of your three card reading. Coming for you right up, the master, the reversed thinker, and the reversed explorer. Hmm. What could we say about these cards, the way that they have um, orientated themselves, and the sequence in which they've come out? The master, quite a good archetype. Semi-spiritual, semi-religious, semi-occultic, semi-magic um, orientated, but the word is master which suggests rulership, which suggests the power to do things in the, in the real world. The sigil itself is vaguely crowned of thorns-like, so you can add whatever meaning you want to that. But what is the Master trying to tell us here? Maybe about a truth which is above your current truth. Maybe about a wisdom which is above your current wisdom. Maybe a goal and aspiration of the kind of person you would like to be. You want to become a guru within your trade so other people will understand you as being a person who has knowledge and wisdom. What is the thinker reverse trying to tell you? That you're not quite there yet. You're on the way, but you're not quite there yet. You've advanced, you've gained some power, you've gained some skills, you've gained some wisdom and knowledge, but you're not quite there. But the explorer is, seems to be suggesting that you've got another journey to go on because it's reversed. You've explored to a certain, a certain depth and detail, but there's something else which is needed yet. It's like a feeling of, do I need to explore further or am I adequate where I am now? Do I have to think things through or am I adequate where I am now? Or should I think that I am adequate anyway but I still thirst for more knowledge and skill development with the passage of time. And what would that be with relevance to your life? I don't know, but you do. Leave a comment in the comment section if you like what I've done, what I've said. If you enjoy the reading itself, then give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to rate and subscribe. And remember, I am your online street performer for today, so I've got my cap out there in the street in the form of the super thanks button. And if you want to motivate me to carry on putting out more content, drop me a few dollars, cents, pounds, whatever you got. Provided, of course, you can afford it. And if you can't, then don't. All right? But after your payday, then you can chip shop me a few dollars then, eh? Kind of thing. I got my left right coordination wrong then, didn't I? But never mind, never mind. I'll see you soon for the next delightful 47th reading. Ta-da!